If you're just getting started with Windows, learning how to navigate the desktop is a great way to start. Let's take a look at the desktop, which is the screen you see here. It includes a desktop background, also known as your wallpaper, and the taskbar at the bottom of the screen. The taskbar is where you'll find shortcuts to some of the applications on your computer, as well as the Start button. You can click the Start button to open the Start menu. Here you can see a list of applications. You can click an application to open it. You can also find shortcuts to your settings, documents, and more. The taskbar is also where you'll find the File Explorer. It allows you to view and open files and folders. For now, I'm going to close the window by clicking the X. Let's check out more features on the desktop. The desktop is the main workspace for your computer. To open a program file or folder, just double-click the icon. Each time you open something, it will appear in a new window. You have the ability to move windows by clicking and dragging the top of the window. When you're done, just release the mouse. If you have more than one window open at a time, you can quickly switch between them by clicking the one you want. Or you can click the icon for it on the taskbar. You can also maximize it so it fills the entire screen. Just click the square near the top right corner. Click it again to return the window to its original size. When you're finished, closing the windows is easy. Just click the X. If you want to quickly search the file settings or applications on your computer, you can use the search feature. Just click the search bar and start typing, and it will show a list of results. Now you know the basics of getting around the Windows desktop. GCF Global, creating opportunities for a better life.